Hi, we're excited to launch this very first Affineur of the Year competition with the Academy of Cheese and the art of affinage, which is the differences that you can make to these nat beautiful naturally rinded cheeses during their maturation process. That art was almost lost in this country when the Milk Marketing Board stored almost all cheese in central stores from the 1940s through into the 1980s. So we even use a French word, affineur and affinage, to describe this process. And to celebrate this little known art and what's possible with it, we've teamed up with the Academy of Cheese to create this competition. So what differences can you make with these cheeses uh, in affinage? Well, you've got time, obviously, temperature, humidity, airflow, maybe. Maybe there's other things. Uh, at, but also there is the distinct microflora of each store which creates a unique flavour in the cheeses that are matured there. A couple of years back we swapped some cheeses over with Jamie Montgomery and we realised that we were creating completely new flavours right to the heart of the cheese. And there are now even scientists studying the microflora of cheese rinds. So we wanted to celebrate this end of the process as much as producing the milk and make, how you make the cheese. So we've selected a single vat that we made in the 19th of February 2021. And at our three month grading, we described it as rich, balanced, complex, creamy, savoury and grassy. So we felt that was a really cool canvas to, uh, on which our competitors could paint whatever they wanted. Um, it's made from one of my favourite heritage starters as well, which is really great. And uh, we've sent one cheese from each, from this vat to each of our competitors. I'm also really excited about who our competitors are. We've got one cheese maker, which is Lincoln Chipotle, but also some of the best cheesemongers in the UK. And I can't wait to see what they'll make of these cheeses, what we'll learn from that process when we come to sample them together on the 24th of February, 2022. And I hope to see you there.